I lost my best friend in Grenfell Tower. I'm a survivor and a bereaved of Grenfell. I lost my friend Isaac through Grenfell. If I had the chance to save him, I would have. He was so young. He didn't even get to have a good future, basically. So it's just sad. Music has helped me cope better with the Grenfell situation. Kids on the Green helps honour the memory of the people that were lost in Grenfell Tower. I've got quite a few friends that were affected from the Grenfell situation. A lot of people, they've lost brothers, sisters, parents, friends, and Kids on the Green, I feel like we try to be as much of that as we can to them. Luana lost her baby brother in the Grenfell Tower fire and is a survivor of the disaster. Dancing and singing helps me both, you know, express how I feel about Grenfell. So me and my friend Lola, we both wrote a song for Grenfell for this, the fifth anniversary. And the song is basically about, you can always overcome a problem, you know, there's always light at the end of the tunnel, having strength, and that you're not alone. Kids on the Green was set up as an emergency response to Grenfell. Five years later, it's a community service that allows young people to develop their artistic skills, well-being, and gain qualifications. We have to kind of backtrack and look at where it all started. Me and Shuka, she was someone I considered a best friend. I knew her from year seven, and I walked her back to Grenfell, and that was literally the last time I saw her. It feels unreal, because, you know, out of tragedy came, you know, this amazing opportunity, this amazing space, amazing people. It's quite incredible. It's helped me a lot, and I know it's helped loads of other people. I feel happy I met the people who are here. It made me feel welcome. It's like a second family. We do the best to help everyone that's been impacted by Grenfell and just make sure that they know that they'll never be forgotten. Jem O'Reilly, BBC London.